Hello, yeah, in this video I will uh, do some demonstrations about how to run uh, R scripts. Okay. Um, so this is the R scripts uh, we just run for the additional practices uh, in base R. So for example, if we use this chunk of R script as example, uh, of course the basic way to run it is just coming to this terminal uh, you just type in the commands one by one, you know, line by line, say one, two, three, and ls again, and you remove the object, ls again. Okay? Uh, this is the, the, the most basic way to do it. Um, the second way um, is you highlight the syntax uh, you want to run. And in your R Studio, uh, okay, up here, there's a green arrow for the run. And you will click on that, and you're going to run the R script you selected. Okay? However, some users reported uh, that after they install the R Studio on their computers, uh, this green arrow uh, did not show up. Um, I, I don't know why, and I don't know how to fix it. Um, but if you're lucky enough to have the green arrow, then you can run your R script this way. Uh, and then, of course, you have the um, control and return where you can run the R scripts one, one line at a time. And also, you can highlight them, and then you can return, control and return to run them all together. Okay? Uh, and this is the, the way we uh, usually uh, do demonstrations in our videos. Okay, um, okay. and uh, another really uh, very old way to run R scripts is simply you just uh, come here and you copy, control C, and then you come to the terminal, control V, you paste it here, oh, sorry, into here, and it's going to run here. Uh, this is actually the way uh, users. Uh, run their R scripts before uh, you know R Studio um, was available. Um, so they basically use a text editor to type up their R scripts and they just copy and paste into the R console uh, terminal here. Um, okay, and the last uh, way I want to um, show you is uh, if you say I don't want to run my R script line by line, I want to run them all of them at once, uh, then you can use the source uh, command here. Um, but you need to make sure you specify the, uh, the path correctly and the file name correctly. So here I show you on my computer this R Lab 3 additional training on base R is located in this folder or this directory. Uh, so I just make sure everything is correct. This typed in here. Uh, and then if I execute this line of uh, syntax, uh, it will just run everything in this R script file. So you can see uh, it created uh, the data frame on the right, it generated the histogram, and uh, up on the right, uh, you can see all the objects uh, created. Okay. Uh, and then, yeah, uh, this is really uh, the source you can command you can use to lar, uh, that's right, to run large uh, R scripts. Uh, so, okay, I hope this is helpful. Uh, thank you so much.